The role of a certified school librarian has evolved dramatically over the past two decades. Today's highly effective school librarian builds a school-wide culture of reading, manages a library space where all students can experience a sense of community and belonging, curates inclusive and culturally responsive library resources to meet students' academic needs and personal interests, and as the only licensed information professional in a school, serves as an instructional leader in the critically important areas of information literacy and digital literacy. One of the fundamental roles of a teacher librarian is to help teachers to build a relevant curriculum in their classrooms. So I will get in their meetings and uh, plan with them, jump in and ask where I can help and when do you want to come to the library? How can we do this? Everyone collaborates with me and I'm busy all the time. And the only time I say no is when I'm already booked to teach with a class. What I see is really the greatest gift she's given um, us as a teacher librarian with the extended essay is just her deep knowledge of research and how to make research and writing a massive paper accessible to students. But kids often come back from college specifically to come and thank our teacher librarian. Another way that our librarian really helps teachers is to collaborate with them and to build a collection that's relevant and important and that can help them both in their vertical and their horizontal alignment of curriculum so that she can be that resource person that oftentimes a teacher doesn't have time to do. A school library media specialist is an amazing support to school personnel, um, both in the classroom and outside the classroom. This is really important, I think, at the elementary and middle school levels, where a lot of times teachers are kind of left to fend for themselves. I and mean, this is the first time I've really gotten to know my librarian and be close with them, and, and it's really been beneficial. I had a recent aerospace project that she helped me find sources on, find I mean, actually proper good, legitimate sources that were something that you'd find at a college level that you never really think a high school library would have access to. And we were able to use that and actually did well in science fair because of the sources in the background. Falling under the umbrella of the, the school library standards are going to be um, ensuring that the information that, that you're receiving is coming from a reliable source. We are losing, many of us, our ability to detect fact from fiction, but also algorithms are getting smarter. Critical media literacy and being able to sort through the massive amount of information that's out there to find exactly what you want for the purposes that you want, that is a skill that librarians learn in library school. From an information literacy and digital standpoint, we're always modeling, practicing, embedding that into all lessons. I see the teacher librarian's role as also keeping our whole staff up to speed on best practice in that field. Our students are adults by the time they leave us, and they need to know what to do with the information that they find, how to identify when they find what they want, and they also need to know when they come across something that's too much for them and how to put it down. And as technology becomes this inextricable piece of our students' lives, I think we need incredible resources like librarians to help students navigate all of it. Something that we do a lot is we underestimate the power of having a school library and a school librarian in library spaces. And then we expect literacy rates to skyrocket and for test results to look a certain way. The library helps me with my fluency in reading so I know more vocabulary and I can speak fluently and I know more words. The difference between test scores when students do not have a teacher librarian in the library and those who do, there's a difference. There was like a 20% a increase. You know, some people are, well, that's silly. It's just information literacy, but it's how it's integrated. 
into all curricular areas. A lot of the times kids come up here and they are stressed and in crisis and we are kind of in a big way first responders to giving them a space where they can have a little bit of room to themselves and work through something with them, try to figure out what kind of other supports that they will need. Our librarians are working to create a space where kids feel like they belong and they feel affirmed when they walk in. I think that is probably the most important work we can do at a school. Like we have to do that work before we can teach anybody anything. School librarians, we are trying to make sure that the outside world is inside and, and vice versa. And so you need to have a steward, somebody who cares and has training and expertise and continues their professional development so that it's continuing to grow and evolve and be diverse and culturally responsive. The librarian of my childhood was shh, quiet <laughs> and I'm all about not quiet. <laughs> I want kids to come and be excited, be curious. My role is to help facilitate that, to make an open, comfortable space. Teacher librarians, certified librarians are in danger. There's always been a need to persuade and advocate for our position, for the funding, for resources. But the teacher librarian, the keyword is teacher. Our work and our education supports the dedication to intellectual pursuit and lifelong learning. It is a challenging time for uh, people to staff their buildings. And I know that schools think, well, this person doesn't really have as much of an impact on students, right? We, we might pick someone who can do an intervention instead. But I truly believe that value has been added to our students in so many ways because of our librarian. For me, librarians, they have access to more kids than your average teacher on a day-to-day -day basis and they really have the ability to be the mentor. In the schools I've worked in in the past without a teacher librarian, you know, you don't feel the hole that exists until you recognize what it is for not being there. A generation from now, school libraries will be thriving. There will be a teacher librarian, if not more than one, in each one, not just in the privileged parts of our nation and state and cities. A solid librarian can make such a substantial difference at your school that you really, really have to make sure that you have the right person there, you give them the right support, and it can do wonders for your school.